Haiti one year after the devastating earthquake of January 2010. 4,000 schools were destroyed, hundreds of teachers lost their lives, but Haiti's education system was dismal even before that. Half a million, half a million children don't go to school. And those who go to school, they go to school and families have to pay. Around 60% of the people don't know how to read and how to write. This is very important as a starting point for the development. We are going to work in the construction of some uh, social centers, social communities to offer the literacy program and the other programs for the family's development. Eighty percent of the families who are living under the level of poverty, that means with less than two dollars a day. These are those families who are paying 40% of their annual income for basic education. SOS Children's Villages sees education as a key to finding a way out of poverty and supports the long-term reconstruction of Haiti's education system. In small village communities such as this one just outside Port-au-Prince, improvised lessons are held at regular intervals. One of the main problems in scheduling these is the blatant lack of qualified teachers. Less than 20% of teachers have the qualifications to teach. Less than 20%. And only 10% of them have received the standard training in a, a pedagogical school, in a normal uh, school for teachers. Only 10%. We will support the uh, uh, teachers' uh, uh, preparation training, at the same time establishing some kind of partnership with the other institution to make it. Lessons at the SOS school in Santo are already being held in two shifts, after the number of students rose to more than 900, almost double as many as before. Plans for the construction of 10 additional public schools are already in the making. So at this level we are planning to not only build schools, around 10 schools, to prepare teachers, many teachers also to support and work in the, in, the, in, the, in the schools we are going to build. At the same time, to develop a new approach in the community development. SOS Children's Villages is promoting the rebuilding of Haiti's education system tirelessly and in spite of complex legal implications and bureaucratic delays. In addition to the 10 new schools, a model school made from shipping containers is being constructed on the grounds of the children's village in Santo, where some of the lessons are currently being held in tents.